First, the online encyclopedia Wikipedia continues to grow. The German version racks up 1.4 million clicks per hour, but there are signs of attempted manipulation on the site, which adds up to a lot of extra work for the Wikipedia community. Henrietta Fiebig is a dedicated Wiki user. The former Berlin Humanities student spends most of her time surfing the online encyclopedia, volunteering as author and administrator. It's fun to work on this project. There are loads of discussions and exchanges of information. But she increasingly encounters articles with misleading information, especially when it comes to politicians and organizations. Like the Wikipedia article about the German company Daimler. Until February 2012, it included a critical paragraph about lobbying, but it was deleted by an IP address belonging to Daimler. Malte Landwehr is paid by companies to legally rework Wikipedia articles. He finances his studies through so-called reputation management. Everything I do here is monitored and regularly viewed by editors and administrators. If I were to lie or censor my articles, they would discover it immediately. That's why I don't feel bad about my line of work. Five years ago, the computer scientist examined 30 Wikipedia articles about DAX-listed companies and found that every third article had been manipulated in some way. Sentences with critical information were removed, sometimes even facts. Many DAX-listed companies have a history of using forced labor under the Nazis. This information is often deleted. Another common method is to copy entire texts from ads. Same thing in politics. During the 2012 US election campaign, the wiki page of Republican politician Newt Gingrich was edited, leaving out accusations of political or personal misconduct. Wikipedia is operated by the Wikimedia Foundation. Pavel Richter is managing director of Wikimedia Germany in Berlin. He has been witnessing manipulation for a long time. I'm sure it's increased. That's simply due to the fact that the significance and recognition of Wikipedia have increased so much. And of course firms, political parties, organizations and PR firms have picked up on this. The Wikipedia community wants to protect the encyclopedia from PR intrusion. If articles are changed too often, they are blocked, as are conspicuous users. But manipulators have other means. One option is to encrypt an IP address in combination with certain proxy servers. Then you can no longer trace the connection to a specific location or firm. Another possibility is to build an account and edit many different subjects in a sensible way. Then you go to an article you want to change and alter it bit by bit. Wikipedia can only do so much against this kind of manipulation. And if discovered, it can severely damage the company's reputation. Despite regular scandals, Wikipedia author Henrietta Fiebig is convinced that there are enough mechanisms of control. If it's such a clear-cut case, it doesn't even take 10 minutes for the article to be closed. I think that on the whole, our system works. Wikipedia is supposed to be an open and free encyclopedia, which also means it should be free of manipulation, especially since knowledge means power and power should not be exploited by individuals. Shift says, knowledge instead of facts.